Hey, this is Deshi Omar from Elite Martial Arts. I hope everyone is doing well. Just shooting this video to go over how I want you to participate with our online training. So first off, I want you in full uniform, right? Make sure you have your uniform on. Um, also, try to send videos of us, uh, of yourself, if you can, if possible, of you participating in the training. That way I can see your technique and I can make little corrections and send that feedback back to you. Also, don't forget that these videos are going to be premiering live on uh, a new feature called YouTube Premiere or YouTube Live, where the, the, the video is released at a certain time. That way you can ask questions live and I'll be there, um, fully accessible to answer your questions. Lastly, I just wanted to say that I am super proud of you guys because if you're checking into this video, that means that you're getting ready to train, um, even when um, you know, you're, you're at home and you're not able to come to the dojo. So that just shows an incredible level of discipline. And we're very proud of you guys, and we can't wait to see you back in class to give you a real high five. <laughs> I'll see you guys. Hey team, glad that you're logging on, and I hope you're ready for an awesome workout. Today we're gonna be just challenging ourselves, making ourselves a little bit better, and uh, one step closer to our black belt, or our next level of black belt, because we have everybody from white belts, yellow belts, all the way up to, to senior black belts that'll be participating in this video. So challenge yourself appropriately, try to have be the top student performing in this, and, uh, and good luck, let's have some fun. Let's start with the down, your hands to your side, your back is straight, let's bow forward, and let's get started with our warm up. So I'm gonna give you one minute, I want you to get a timer. We're gonna start off with one minute of jumping jacks. I wanna see how many you can do in one minute. Be sure to comment when you're done how many you did. Get ready and go. Perfect, next we're gonna do squats. So what I want you to do, hands up, back straight. Again, one minute of squats. I wanna see how many you can do. If squats are way too easy and you're looking for more of a challenge or you're just in an all-star mood today and you wanna give your best and get 100% better, let's go for jump squats. So when you're doing a squat, just one thing I want you guys to pay attention to is having per proper squat form. Keeping your hands up, your back straight, and sitting back like you're sitting in a chair. When you do this, all the weight should be in your heels. Sometimes when we do our squats, our knees go forward, which is an improper way to do the squat. You want to sit back, so that way your toes can come off the floor, and then also your back stays straight. So let's do as many squats as you can in one minute. If you need more of a challenge, sit back and jump up. One minute, go. Perfect. The last one I want to see is one minute of mountain climbers. So you're going to be down for push-ups, one knee is up to your chest, and you're just quickly switching your feet. Let's see how many you can do. Don't forget to comment. You know what, we're over two, let's do a little bit more. So, now we're gonna go on your back. Hands tight to your body. I'm gonna do as many crunches as you can in one minute. Go for it, go! And last one, best one, what we're gonna do for this last exercise is high knees. So you're gonna have your hands up, you're gonna be lifting your knees up as high as you can, as many as you can. Each time your knee comes up, that counts as one. So let's see how many you can do in one minute. Good luck team, go for it. All right, great job with the warm-up. Now here's what we're gonna move on to next. We're gonna review all of your basics. So your hands are gonna be tight, your back is straight. We're gonna start by yourself. I want you to knock out 10 of your best reverse punches. From here, straight out. Remember to rotate your hand out, keep a tight chamber, your back straight, and punch with a nice LDL. Next, after your reverse punches, I wanna see palm heel strikes. 
After that, we're going to do spear hand strikes. And after that, the last one we're going to do is throw grabs, just like this. If this is too easy to do it standing and you want even more of a challenge, then let's do it in a horse stance. You're going to get a strong horse stance, and from here, you're going to throw your strong punches. Go for it. Go. Next. Next, let's review our basic kick. So we're going to start off in a left side kicking stance with your hands up and your front foot in trigger position. Your heel is going to be off the floor. Your hands are going to be up, glued to your face. This hand glued to your cheek, this hand out in front of your face. And let's go for 10 of your best snapping front kicks. Don't forget to chamber tight, kick out, recoil, and then bring it back. 10 fast. One, two, all the way to 10. Pause the video and then resume. We'll be back for the next kick. Go for it. Next, we're going to do roundhouse kicks. So you have your hands up. Again, body turned to the side, pivoting your back foot, hands up by your face. I want to see 10 of your best snapping roundhouse kicks. So your knee comes up, point your knee out, toes pull back. You kick out, bring it back, and then drop your foot. 10, as fast as you can. If you need a challenge, try to do all 10 or go from one to 10 without dropping your foot. So challenge number one for our maybe intermediate students would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Challenge number two would be one, one, two, one, two, three, all the way to ten. Good luck. Great job reviewing your basics team. Let's go right into our final challenge of the day. So today what we're gonna do as our challenge is you're gonna be down for push-ups, and I wanna see you're gonna give yourself 30 seconds. Give yourself three tries if you want. You can take one, two, three, as many tries as you want, but keep your highest score. Get as many push-ups as you can done in 30 seconds, record your score, and then tomorrow we're gonna try to beat that score. Good luck team. Great job today team. It was great working with you guys. I can't wait to see you guys back in the mat, but I'm super proud of you guys for being so disciplined and training at home. I can't wait to see you guys soon. Let's snap, back forward, and one, two, three.